Welcome back everyone from schools to businesses. United Way of Cass Clay strives to make positive changes in our community. Christy Huber, Madam President as I call her, <laughs> the President of United Way of Cass Clay <laughs> is here to talk about how they're helping a local school this morning and a lot of other great things that they're up to here in our community. Great to have you here. Yeah, oh, so I'm nice good to see, see you. So excited to see both of you this so morning. Do you Thank want to start so with UND hockey or? <laughs> oh, you know, were you watching the draft last night? Oh no, no. <laughs> the expansion draft. I was totally joking. <laughs> oh, <laughs> she's ready. She's I'm prepared for anything. I, I'm that you prepared know. to talk about hockey, but it is really nice to be with you, and we are so excited at United Way. This has been a spectacular week for our community and especially the West Fargo schools because um, actually on Monday we announced that United Way would be investing and our donors would be investing $25,000 and also now it's matched with Sanford Health dollars of $25,000. So $50,000 going towards the West Fargo Public School District so that they can hire a student wellness facilitator. And we are so excited about this because we know that this will impact many Many students in the West Fargo School District. So what does that mean specifically? What, what are we looking at? So this is actually um, something that was piloted with the Fargo School District and the Moorhead School District. And what it is is a student wellness facilitator actually works directly with the students. And so it's um, someone who's professionally trained, maybe even a social worker, that actually will meet students at their point of need. So if we have students that are um, facing depression, if they are facing suicide, if maybe they have things that are going on at home that they just really need some extra help to work through, this student wellness facilitator is there to actually be that intervention and get them the assistance that they need. And so the, the program actually is through Imagine Thriving and Abby Tao is the executive director. She does a fantastic job. And so we're just excited to be able to be a part of this to bring this to the West Fargo School District. What kind of numbers are we talking about? We'd like to think that kids don't need this, but the need is there. The need is there. Well, and we know that there have been some struggles um, with children across the school districts. We, we see suicides um, in our school districts and we want to make sure that we are providing interventions and that we're collaborating across the community to help those kids but to your point of, of how many students last year Abby just shared with me that over 270 students were helped in the Fargo School District through their work with their student wellness facilitators and over 91 students were helped in the in the Moorhead Public School District and so through those numbers and the data, we know that this intervention is powerful and it's working. That was my nice question. So what, what's the data showing? So you work with these 270 students and your outcomes are what? So those are 270 students that actually accessed the, the program mm -hmm. and utilized a student wellness facilitator. And it's not just high school students. This is students that are across elementary school, middle school, and high school. And so again, it's again being smart about how do we help kids at their point of need and the sooner that we can find those interventions the sooner that we can um, be able to get them the help that they need these student wellness facilitators are amazing um, they not only help students in the school and during school hours but they're also available to the students outside of school and outside of school normal days as well um, sometimes what they do is they will actually take students to appointments and so they'll be able to make sure that whatever those interventions are um, that need to happen, they make those possible. And Imagine Thriving is doing a wonderful job with this program. Easy mission to support. When we come back, we're going to talk about something people can do today to help out and also have a great lunch too. We'll be right back.